So for today, we're going to be talking about the marathon armor. Uh, I'm going to be real with you guys. I like the armor for the hunters and Titan, the warlocks. I don't just like, wow. Wow. We'll we'll talk about it when we get to the warlock. But uh, yeah, I would have had the armor a little bit sooner. But unfortunately, I had to. Well, I'm not. Unfortunately, I had to go uh, out of town because my mom was vid visiting me. So that's why I was pretty much uh gone from the whole weekend i did have videos up so that way you guys didn't feel the loneliness too much but before we get started if you guys like the video like like comment and subscribe it really does help me uh grow as a channel not only that but a lot of people that are coming into my channel are not subscribed you guys can do me a favor and subscribe that really really would be appreciated uh, only if you like the video obviously but Again, I would very much appreciate it. It only takes like a second. And if you guys don't like me within a month, you guys can only unsubscribe. So let's get right into it and let's talk about the hunters real quick. So this is the hunter. I actually love this armor set, not as a whole, because I think like I think the cloak is like the probably the worst part for me. Uh, the helmet is pretty cool. I actually really do like it uh, specifically with a build that I have, but this this helmet is very not only very serviceable but you can use it on so many pieces the cool thing is i think each each piece from this even the cloak you can use it in different pieces i actually am using all of this armor in different pieces i'll show you guys at the end of this but overall i really do like it let's look how it shaders real quick i personally think it shaders really well surprisingly because i was expecting something to not be shaderable but everything is shaderable even the cloak everything is shaderable nothing is out of uh balance with it so that's pretty cool i very much appreciate that because you guys know how much i feel about pieces that cannot be shaderable uh even even the the shelling or the the uh pockets for the shells even change color which is fantastic again like i said very much appreciate that uh for the helmet like i said i really do like this helmet a lot i know my, some people might not like it but i like it for a specific build that i have with my Om omniculus uh the arms are super dope i have this on i don't remember who i have this on i have the arms on someone specifically i just don't remember off the top of my head uh oh it was for the uh i already made that video the the zers zers exotic challenge number eight uh yeah that one's really cool i very much like that one the chest piece is like maybe one of the few pieces where i'm like i don't know where i would put this but even still i still think this would be really cool i'm specifically thinking about maybe put putting it with the uh neoteric uh cloak i'll show you guys in a bit the boots oh my god the boots i was most excited about because this is the actual piece that i'm wearing with my uh omniculus set right now i was using the helmet but i took it off because i think the boots uh look a little bit better and then last but not least the cloak like i said i'm not a big fan of the cloak just because uh it's uh it's a little weird i don't like the backpack i've never i've never really been a big fan of backpacks but this one is a little bit better than the other one from the moon so i guess i'll be okay with that i don't know i'm gonna be real with you guys i don't know the references for all of these uh from what i do know uh muffin bandit does know and he has it in his video so be more than happy to check out his video i love his stuff so let's look at actually the stuff that i'm wearing for me at my actual builds so for the first one it's gonna be this one right here and it's very i like it a lot so this is what i'm wearing for my omniculus and the reason i'm wearing these boots is because it goes really well with the under armor right here as you guys can see and i actually love how my my hunter came out i think the only thing i don't like is the cloak itself but at that point i don't really care like i can't find something that has that the same marking because like i love these two combinations um i do think it's a little weird because like this is a big ass chest piece and then like a little bit of armor but i feel like it goes well with it because of the the uh, pattern uh for my other one where is it where i just saw it oh here oh that's right so i'm using it with my fallen themed armor because i just feel like it looks a lot better because the one that i was wearing before just 
looked a little weird i'm not gonna lie to you guys let me just show you guys real quick so this is how it looks i like it because it it's it's bulky but not super duper bulky and this is the one that i was wearing before and i like it because of this side this side's really cool but then you get to this side and it's just naked so that's why i'm using the this one because again i really like the uh the fact that it, both sides are almost the same with the exception of this having more art more ammo but i feel like that really goes with this look because obviously grenade here uh, more ammo here a knife here i don't know what the fuck that is but it looks like uh, weapon shit. so it makes sense thematically so that's pretty much it i mean i guess i can show you guys how my hunter looked before with the omniculus because i was using the helmet which i think the helmet looks really good with it uh, <clears throat> it is right here. So for this one, I was going for more. Wait, not the chest piece. There we go. So for this one, I was going more for a my helmet doesn't have any eyes type thing, and it was only on the hel on the chest piece. So I really did like this combination. I might still use this and just use a different cloak, just because I do think it looks really cool. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, I do actually like the cloak, but at that point I'd be using three pieces and I I have a rule that I can't use more than three pieces. Um, I actually would use this. This actually looks pretty dope. So yeah, let me know what you guys think in the comments below, Hunters. Let me know what you guys think. I'm, I'm in love with this armor set for the Hunters just because of the versatility of each piece. Uh, for real like all, all the pieces have so much utility like i can use them on pretty much anything i want uh i'm gonna start using a, uh, these pieces a little bit more you guys already saw or actually hold on i don't know if i've posted that video yet <clears throat> yeah i did so you guys already saw my my streetwear infuse set uh number one i'm gonna be posting another one pretty soon because each piece is so good uh the warlocks even got a good armor set which is a little weird but yeah let's go on to the titan and for the titan we have the uh i can't even say that name it's right there um, this armor is pretty cool but at the same time kind of dumb in my opinion so you guys, people who have come to my channel a lot and know my my taste probably already know what it is uh, but let's go on to the helmet first the helmet. I actually love the helmet. The helmet is super dope Cannot wait to use this this helmet with like other like knightly armor. No shader I think it looks really cool shaders really well the whole the whole set shaders really well if I'm not, if I'm gonna be honest Which I, surprises the shit out of me if I'm being honest But yeah, this this set looks really cool the helmet specifically it it looks some like something out of fucking Dark Souls And I love it um the arms are the piece that kind of like irk me the most uh because of this the light right here if it was on both sides for sure fuck it let's go but it's not on both sides for you know obvious reasons because bungie likes to fucking fuck with me so again like the like i said the cool thing is the fact that it shaders really well even the light changes thank god uh it does really shader it shaders really well thankfully so if you guys are like wondering like oh that doesn't look like it's gonna shader well it actually shaders really well and that's something i'm very happy for because uh bungie has a track record of just being like no this color doesn't change color here because like why would it and it's like yeah yeah of course why would it so all right again i'm not the biggest fan of asymmetrical look which is the blight right here but I could definitely use it in some piece, so it's not. I'm not like that angry about it. I'm, if I'm being honest, I'm not angry at Autobot. This armor set looks fucking cool. Um, chest piece is very basic in my opinion, but it's very serviceable. I can definitely use this in other pieces. Again, the only thing that you might notice is the fact that there's not like a big uh, piece in the back that's like covering the neck, which is like again one of my biggest pet peeves for titan armor i think titan armor sh definitely should have coverage in the back of the neck but that's just me uh for the shaders again it shaders really well uh all the pieces shader really well thankfully uh we'll go through all of it like shaded at the end boots are super dope uh yeah these boots are super cool i definitely cannot wait to use these with a, a nightly look because you could definitely make it work 
uh, not only make it work, but it, I think it's going to look really good with certain pieces. Uh, I'm already loving these boots. Unfortunately, I don't have an armor set with uh, with any of these armor pieces because I got the I got this one and the warlock around the same time, which means that I didn't have much time to uh, fuck around with the armor pieces. So you won't see any anything from me for this one, but I will. Damn, it looks so cool. So I just remembered the streetwear infused armor is only for the streetwear. I haven't done the marathon one, so. Ignore what my dumbass said not too long ago. I will have marathon infused sets, obviously, for probably this week. I am moving out this week, so I don't know if I'll have them up in time, but hopefully we will. But again, I I think I'm first and foremost, Bungie, thank you for not limiting a color in this set because this set looks really cool. Uh, again, I think the only piece that I won't be able to use because I'm just picky is going to be the arms. I think the arms are the only thing that I'm going to be very picky with. Other than that, helmet's going to be using... I'm going to be using the helmet a lot. I already use the helmet a lot, actually. Uh, the the chest piece, I'm going to use it in a bit of stings. But the boots are is going to be the thing that I'm going to be using a lot. And the mark as well. I think the mark is super dope, too. So... Titans, let me know what you guys think. You guys like your armor? Let me know in the comments below. Next up, we have the Warlocks and... Oh, man. After that, I'll give you my final thoughts. So this is the Warlock, the fetish cover. I'm not going to lie to you guys. Warlocks, you guys... You guys got dicked so hard in this one. It's so unfortunate because I was so happy to see the titans and the and the hunter and i was like man that looks super cool and then i saw the warlocks and i was like wow so y'all just don't care about warlocks cool it's so fucking terrible helmet i actually hate the helmet it's super terrible uh not only is it terrible but it's <sighs> one of my biggest pet peeves in armor armor sets is when they make pieces connect to each other literally connect to each other look at this Without the helmet, you're gonna look stupid without without the helmet. Vice versa, without the chest piece, you're gonna look dumb because you're not gonna have this spinal cord thing come connecting. So, yeah, this is terrible. Uh, I don't like the helmet at all. The helmet's like, I wanna say it's the worst piece, but I think the chest piece is the worst piece. Arms, are, I think, are pretty fine. Like, they're normal, they're normal, they're normal arms. They're nothing crazy to look at. Uh, again, uh, arms and boots are usually like whatever's it's literally the chest piece and the helmet that make or break an armor set for a warlock and unfortunately this is not even a make or break this is legitimately trash i don't want to i don't want to say like i don't want to be toxic about it because someone worked on this but it's just like why did you work on this this looks terrible this looks absolutely terrible like terrible it looks bad i do not like this armor set at fucking all um some positive things i like i guess it's cool that the crystal in the middle changes color like i appreciate that but uh everything else is horrid like i don't like the fact that there's a big ass plate right here that kind of looks like a the the end of a tub and then here just looks like oh yeah uh we just cut a towel and just put it right there it looks terrible it looks absolutely terrible i could think of a million ways i could have designed this better uh because in all honesty it's just terribly designed in my opinion like i think oh man they should have just cut these pieces up in different in the, the, the plate they should have just cut it up in different pieces i think there's way too much cloth there's not enough armor pieces and even then like it's so much cloth bro uh, the plate itself looks fucking gross the, the like the thing here like the under armor pieces looks okay but it just looks terrible at the same time Oh, boots. I don't even know how the boots look. I'm honestly, I'm just kind of like just out of it right now. Like I'm so sick and tired of warlocks not getting like, like this is 
this is another level of getting dicked on because this is terrible looking i'm not even like i'm not i'm not gonna sugarcoat it because whoever, whoever designed this i'm sorry i know you worked on this i don't want to make you feel like you wasted your time and that your work is not appreciated but dude it's it's just bad and I, like obviously uh it's subjective because obviously people have their own taste and whatnot but when i see this armor set the first thing i think of is like yeah like i think like oh shit this looks like alien like not not the alien but like alienish like it looks like like out of this world and all that shit but then I see the cloak and the like the chest piece in general, and I'm just like, it looks so terrible, bro. It looks absolutely terrible. Um, yeah, if I had designed this, there'd be like an armor piece here, maybe an armor piece in the in the chest piece, and then like also more armor pieces within like the actual set. I just, oh my god, dude. I think the coolest part is a mar is, is a bond maybe, and even then like. Yeah, the bond's probably the coolest piece. Uh, it's just, <clears throat> again, I don't, I don't want to come across as like, oh, this is the shittiest thing, and whoever designed this, I hate. The, like, it's it's very subjective. I understand that. It's just that there comes a point where, yeah, it's subjective, but like a majority of people won't, won't will not like this armor set. Like, more people like. I know there's gonna be that one weirdo. Oh, well, I like that armor set. I'm gonna rock it. It's like, yeah, but you're not like the majority. You're like, you're the minority with it. <clears throat> I don't know. Warlocks, let me know what you guys think. I think you guys got dicked hard on this one. This armor looks absolutely terrible. Terrible. Like the helmet's fine. Like the helmet actually looks pretty cool and very serviceable. And then you get to that back and you're like, oh, it's connected to a fucking spine. Never mind. I can't. Ah, oh, Bungie. I don't. I don't. This was not it, bro. This was not it. This is terrible. And like, like this is terrible. Even with different shaders, it's just the the fact that like. There's an armor, like, there's an armor set or armor plate here that just looks like a fucking the end of a tub, and then all this cloth. I'm just like, I don't know, man. I don't know if this was the play. If if we could get a rearm, like someone redesign this armor, please. Like this looks terrible. This absolutely looks terrible. Warlocks, let me know what you guys think. Uh, Hunters, let me know what you guys think. And Titans, let me know what you guys think. Uh, overall, I think the hunter probably has the best look for me, <clears throat> mostly because I will be utilizing probably almost every piece. Uh, same thing with the Titans. The Titans, I'll probably utilize every piece as well, aside from the arms. But again, that also applies to the hunters. I'll probably only use or not not use the cloak for my hunter. Everything else I'll probably use. So Titans and, and Hunter, I think, got really good armor sets. The Warlock is the only one I think got like the shittiest looking ever like this is probably the worst armor set i've ever seen for a warlock and uh we've had a few bad ones so to say that and i don't i don't again i don't want to demean the person who designed this i don't want to demean anyone that worked on this i'm just gonna be real some are some armor sets are just bad and warlocks have a lot of them but for fucking whatever reason i don't understand it uh stop giving Ar warlocks bad armor like stop it give them good armor they deserve it so actually no y'all don't y'all don't deserve it y'all have fucking busted ass supers never mind i'm just kidding i'm just kidding uh but yeah let me know what you guys think in the comments below if you guys want to follow me on my social media it's in the description below i thank you all for coming to this point and i'll see you guys later